So, today, apparently Montana made a liar out of me. We're not going into spring yet. It's still winter. It snowed like three inches last night. But it's super warm today. So hopefully, all this stuff is gonna melt soon. And we can get into springtime. Um, but it's pretty warm today. So I think it's a good day to do another project on the truck. So today, what we're going to be working on, this is going to be our solution for a cheap cargo basket on top of the Xterra for right now. So let me go ahead and show you how you can go ahead and make yourself a cargo basket for 120 bucks. So what we have here on the floor are two hitch receive cargo baskets. Uh, you can pick these up at Harbor Freight, 60 bucks a piece. We have $120 here. And basically what you're going to do is we're just gonna cut the insides of the basket so we can meet them together and fit them in between the roof rack on the Xterra. Um, really no hardware you need. You can reutilize all the hardware that these come with. All you need is a cutoff wheel and a drill bit. And then I will show you how to mount it down to the roof rack. So the gap between the roof rack is about 34 and a half inches. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut them right before the bend right here on either side and then once we get those cut off so we can meet them together we can spread them out just a bit and use the existing rails we can use the piece that would slide into your hitch mount to conjoin the middles together like it usually would be and then we can utilize, we have four of these. So now we can take these and can join around the outside corners. Um, I did this on my last truck, super sturdy. I've carried a uh, spare wo or a wood for campfires and a spare tire up here. I've even stood on this myself and was taking pictures off a trail and things like that. So it'll hold a couple hundred pounds still, like cutting it apart's not going to weaken it at all. And I had it on my last truck for about a year and had no problems with it. It's a great, cheap, temporary solution just to get some more storage. So let's go ahead and grab our cutting wheel and uh, start cutting these apart. there it is basket rack all done tied together oh. now we just got to take that and put it on top of that so now we're gonna want to come Ooh. 
We're gonna come. Blah, blah. We're gonna want to come up here and move our roof rails, and we're gonna keep these for a little bit. Maybe we can repurpose them. We'll probably eventually get rid of them all together, but we'll take these and move them all the way forward. That way we can slide our rack right in here through the middle. So let's go ahead and find the right star bit to loosen these up so we can move these down. So now that we have our roof rack somewhat in place, now we got to secure it to our existing rails. And how we're going to do that is you're going to want to go to Home Depot or Lowe's or any hardware store and pick up this version of a pipe clamp. I think these are two two and a half inch and I made the rack wide enough this time that I have more room with the lies the last one I cut a little too short and I had to put a spacer in there but these ones should fit a whole lot better so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take these So we're gonna use the U shape on the crossbar, give it a little bit tighter seal, put that plate on, flat washer, and our nut. And then you'll just repeat the same thing on the other side. So there we are. Cheap roof rack installed, 120 bucks. All the hardware you needed, you just gotta get some U-bolts and it'll hold quite a bit of weight. I'll prove it.
Doesn't get much better than that. So we're gonna call it here for this install. I might do another one today, but that'll be a separate video. Uh, if you guys like what you saw, like, comment, subscribe down below, share it around. Let's build up our community. So I appreciate you guys. And uh, if you have any questions, comments, let them down below. Like I said, I got this from Harbor Freight. Any of you guys can do it. It's just a grinding wheel and uh, a drill. So go build yourself a cheap roof rack and get yourself out in the woods. We'll see you guys on the next one. Later.